I was doing a lineup because I couldn't. Oh no, I didn't. Oh, oh my shit! god! Oh my god! She's mid dash! Revealing area. There's no cooking team. There they are. <laughs> Hello, Sova mains. Today we're gonna learn a lot of juicy recon darts. I know that you have requested me for a long time to make these kind of videos, and I know I've been slacking, but anyway, it's coming. So, we're starting off with A. I think a Sova should either play A or C because of all the info he can get from one of the sides. And what I would do if I play A is just stand up against this spawn barrier. And then I would place my left diamond right into the slide bulb like this and do a one bar. Deep breath. And it's gonna look like this. Revealing area. So what this one does, it reveals garden, but it also reveals people that will stand here. So you can actually assist your team peeking from B for some wall bank kills, which is super cool. If they're pushing you on A and you're forced to fall back, you can also go into this corner and do the retake god arrow, where you just put the left diamond right in the corner of this one and do a full charge like this. Revealing area. And this is gonna reveal the entire site. It's super good. There's also a nice wall bang arrow that lands into sewers. Um, this is uh, one of my most popular arrows I've ever made. Uh, it's very hard to line up though. You need to find the brick with this crack on it and then line yourself up like this and Then you're gonna take your right diamond and just put it a few pixels Over this corner here like this and do two bounce two bar Revealing area and it's gonna bounce off of the window back in a main and Then land down in sewers here if you're standing here, you can wallbang with Odin. And if you stand here, you can actually also wallbang with medium penetration weapons. If this arrow gets shot a lot, you can also do the one bounce. It will reveal less, but it's going to be harder to kill. You can also do a wallbang arrow for A main. You just get into this corner and you're going to use the dark spot here. And do a one bar jump. Revealing area. And this one will land back here and reveal A main. And you can wallbang through here with Odin or Operator or other heavy penetration weapons. If you're playing B, you can use the same lineup spot that we used for the sewer wallbang. But this time we're gonna use the A main wallbang lineup. So you're gonna aim for this dark spot once more and do a one bar jump. Revealing area. And this one will land at the back of the window here. So you can wallbang people from B main. It is really smart to ask your teammate to smoke the window in this case to force them from not pushing out because then you can be basically holding this angle and just focus on wall banging people. If you're suspecting that they're gonna push out middle or just want a lot of mid control you can get into this corner like this and just aim for the top corner of this flag and do a one bar one bounce and it's just neatly gonna land in the window frame here and reveal most of middle including inside the window. If you suspect that they're rotating from A or B or maybe all the way to C, you can actually do an arrow where you get into this corner here and then you aim for the very top of this window like this somewhere in this area and do a full charge double bounce. Revealing like area. This. And this is gonna bounce out here and then land at back of Terra spawn. And even C's in here. There's also an arrow that reveals garage that you can actually wall bang on by getting into this corner until you stop. And just aim for the middle of this line and do a double bounce full charge. Revealing area. And then you can wall bang right on this wooden panel with medium and high penetration weapons. If you want to reveal more of second mid, you can get into this corner and then you place your left diamond right under this flag like this. It doesn't need to be super accurate and do a one bar. Revealing area. It's gonna land on the ledge here and reveal most of this area. If you're defending C, you can either use this one, which is super simple. You just go into this corner here, aim for this very corner like that. Full charge, one bounce. Revealing area. 
It's gonna land right on this corner, it's hard to destroy and it also reveals here. Or, you can just aim for slightly under this tip here and do a full charge arrow. I'm just gonna hit the branch area. right here. And still reveal most of this. I used to do recons from this corner, but it's kind of scary because if they're pushing you, you don't have anywhere to run. And I usually play Sova as a retake champion here instead now, so I run out here, do double shocks, and then push back in with my team. That's why I now do recons from the left side instead. If you're suspecting that they're rotating towards A through T-spawn garden, you can get into this corner here, and then you can create a corner. You see this dot and this end? Where they meet here, you can create a corner there. Do one bounce full charge like this. Revealing you can practice area. the pixel perfection of this one yourself. But it's gonna land right here. Like that. And if they push you and you want to retake with your team, you can get into this corner here. Just do a full charge one bounce while aiming for this brick corner here. And it should reveal Revealing most of the area. side really easily. Even this spot. Okay, so on attack, the best arrow for A is the god arrow, but obviously this one is really hard because it's kind of pixel perfect. But what you're gonna do, you're gonna place your bottom left HUD line just on the left edge of this very treetop. You just need to practice this one a lot. So it's gonna be something like this. And then you do two bar no bounds. Revealing area. And this one reveals everything on site here and even people rotating from B main. It's an insane arrow. If you want a fast and easy alternative, you can just stand here and just aim for this tip here, just as it aligns with the background like this, and do two bar. Revealing area. Just aligns there. If you want an arrow to reveal inside window, you can get into this corner until you stop. And then you're gonna put your left diamond, the bottom of your left diamond right inside this one, like this, and do a one bar. Revealing area. Lands right there. It still reveals a lot of sight as well. For attacking B, you can also do the god arrow there. This one is also super hard to line up. Recently they changed the design of the charge bar, so I had to make a new lineup for this one. So you're still going to be aiming for somewhere around this area, but you're going to use this roof edge here to understand when you're in the right spot, because this edge should just disappear on the left of your screen. So if you look now, I'm looking to my left until that little edge disappears, and then I do Two bar, two charge. Revealing area. This one goes in through the window there, bounces off the back wall, and lands right on this yellow gong here. Again, this one is really precise, but you just need to practice it. It does work. If you want a fast and easy alternative, all you have to do is just aim between these two. Just do a Revealing one bounce area. click. Just lands in the front. It's also nice if they're pushing out here, you can stop them. Fighting over garage is quite essential in most rounds, so a really nice arrow for this is to get up against the spawn barrier and then you're gonna align your top HUD line with this corner like this. You see this line there? You align it in the corner like this and do a full charge double bounce. Ready! And this one's gonna bounce area. through this. And right back here, I've received a lot of wallbang kills with this one. You basically just tell your team to spray the doors while you shoot the arrow, and then these uh, protective barriers should go away, and you'll be able to wallbang someone when they get revealed. For C, I pretty much use two alternatives. You have the standard one that a lot of people use, just get into this corner and just aim for the tip of this leaf and no one bar. Revealing area. It's really good, but a lot of people expect this one. That's why I also made an alternative that is a bit trickier to shoot. So you just align yourself up with these lines like this and you just aim for the top of this wooden panel with a one bounce full charge like this. Revealing area. You can practice on making this one hit all the way down on the tip to make sure that it also reveals back here. Okay guys, so that was my recon guide for Haven. I will post guides for the other maps as soon as possible. 
And I hope that you would like to subscribe to my channel if you enjoy this content very much. And I'll see you on the daily streams at Twitch. Thank you for watching.